And here's an Acer IoT kit. What is this? Uh, that is our Acer own brand called Cloud Professor, which is for the education. So this is a HDMI stick, the Cloud Processor Professor. Yeah, Cloud Professor. Uh, actually, it's an embedded system with all customized software inside. So is it Linux? Uh, we have two editions. One is Windows, and the other one is uh, Ubuntu. So what what happens with this platform? Uh, there's Arduino, there's yeah. Intel stick, and there's a robot. Okay, yeah. This, this is our standard package. So we will start from here. There are six modules inside. Uh, for the sensor module, we have a light sensor, two sensor for the motion and uh, PM 2.5 to detect the dust, air quality or something. And that is servo motor and LED and button. These are two developing board. One is a famous Arduino and the other one is a common GPIO board. So is this like a ARM Cortex M3 based or is it... Uh... Uh, actually, we, we, try, we just try make a normal a... Arduino? Yeah, Uno. normal Arduino. Yes. Yeah? And then... Uh... And and what is in here? Oh, this access accessory. Accessories. Um, and so um, this is a cloud professor. What is he talking about in this video? Uh, in this video, we are first we talk about the history. Why yeah. Acer want to re, uh, introduce the education kit? And we already have the education kit for microprocessor like uh, around 35 years ago. And now it's a cloud and the IoT era. So we want to introduce a new education kit. And this is our demo. So this is for the IoT era. So this is yes. a big push. Uh, yeah. It's an open platform. Yeah, this is an Acer Cloud technology called AOP as an open platform. So what is running in this uh, Intel stick? What software is this? Uh, that's an Acer customized software. For IoT? Yes. And uh, based on our Acer open platform technology. And this one you can see, plug in the GPIO with the LED module. And your mobile side, you will receive a message. And which tell you, uh, tell you which app you need to download. Everything happens automatically. So how old is this kit? Alright. Just released now? Uh, this one, we are going to launch this education kit at the end of this year in Asia market first. Asia market first? Asia market, so, yeah, like Taiwan, China. Yeah. And so uh, this is it, this information right here? Yes. Uh, cloud, professor, yeah, what's the I cost know. for a kit like this? Is there a price? Uh, uh, so far, uh, for the retail price, there will be next year. And it's around like uh, 250 US dollars. Okay. Uh, that will include the uh, hardware, hostware, and the uh, app with source code. Is it possible to do different uh, host modules uh, with an open platform? People can make uh, different CPU in here? Uh, that will be next generation. Yeah. yeah, we are working on that. What what is the next generation CPU? Uh, People can wait and see. Uh, ah, yeah. <laughs> yes, uh, please let me keep the secret. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. And uh, this is a user experience. Uh, easy design systems. Yes. Work with you. Uh, you just use yeah. our education key, and you want to give us some idea about that. All right. So uh, then this robot will be able to do lots of things. Yeah, we want to show people if you have a lot of knowledge about hardware, you still can use the operation with the GBIO board we provide. And you can easily buy the chip control board on the internet. Wheel, motor, body, and the power bank. What is this yourself. control board? It's a controller motor. Right. So we provide the GBIO app. So you, if you insert a uh, right pin, you still can control the power. What are the other possibilities with uh, with uh, this cloud system, BYOC? What can people do with this kit? Uh, what are the possibilities? Uh, as I'm saying, the most important thing is focus on the idea. You don't need to deal in with the data transfer, like a security, privacy, something. So we have more modules, so people can do what they want to do, use using what uh, the module he wants, and then 
do the app, to do the coding stuff, to do what they want to do. But they don't need to think of the cloud uh, work or test or something.